Testing one, two. Kathy, let me know if you can see the PowerPoint here. Is it good? Okay, be back in five minutes. Everybody. Hello everyone and welcome to Chevron Online Trader Seminar. We want to welcome each and every one of you to the presentation today. Melissa Armo is your host and presenter. We'll be starting promptly in just three minutes here at Online Trader Central. Again, this is Online Trader Central. And we start promptly in just three minutes.
Hello, everyone, again, and welcome. This is Kevin with Online Trader Central. It is exactly 4.30, and with that, let me round up the trumpets and the, tr and the percussion section. Okay, drummers, are you ready? And with that, ladies and gentlemen, it is time to begin. Please put your hands together and welcome our host and presenter today from the stockswish.com. Please welcome Melissa Armo. Thank you so much, Kevin, and thank you, everyone at Online Trader Central. Welcome. Welcome today. My name is Melissa Armo, and I own a company called the Stock Swish LLC. Today's lecture is going to be on something that's very personal for me, very, very meaningful for me. And it is my 26-point trademark system. So for those of you that are new to trading, we're going to talk today about a trading system. And for those of you that have traded before our trading right now, you are already aware of the fact that having a trading system is important. And we're going to talk about this today. If you'd like more information, feel free to go to my website, www.thestockswish.com, and Kathy has my information in there. You can also feel free to email me at melissa at thestockswish.com. I have a lot of videos on YouTube. You can go there and check it out or join me at any one of these places. Uh, feel free to reach out and email me if you have any questions today after the lecture. What is the purpose of having a trading system. And again, if you're new to trading, this is great to go, go over and review. And it's a good review even if you're trading right now. The purpose of having a trading system is so that you have a structure to follow each day when you trade. If you have a system that works, all you do each morning is follow it. It's a structure. And it makes it easy for you to trade. Otherwise, you're trading what I call on the fly and probably in fear. In other words, if you don't have a structure to follow every day for what you're supposed to be doing and why you're supposed to be doing it, then you're really trading on the fly. And your results are probably going to reflect that. I have found that having a system takes out the fear. And many, many people do have this, this fear about risky money in the market when they trade. But if you have a system that you know works and you believe in, it alleviates that, it takes it out, it lessens it, it, it gets rid of it. And having that leads to less stress, okay, when you're trading. If you have a structure to follow, oh, then you follow it. It leads to less stressful and more relaxed trading because you just do what you know you're supposed to do. Having a quality system also leads to more consistent and substantial profits, which obviously is very important if you want to make money in the market. So what's the purpose of, of the 26-point rating system that I do, what I created, what I made up, and what I'm going to talk about today my 26-point system evaluates the daily chart of a stock to carefully determine the day's directional bias. Trades are rated each morning using the 26-point rating system. The 26 points use advanced technical analysis to determine the correct price action for the stock on the day. Easy, okay? Except for how do you do it, and we're going to talk about that. As a trader myself, doing this analysis and having the 26-point system is a huge advantage. My 26-point trademark system gives me an edge in the market, and it will give you an edge as a trader if you learn it. And that's what's so amazing about this. It's something that I created for myself, for myself. I never created it to teach anyone. I never in my life thought I'd be teaching people anything to do with trading. But as it turns out, I'm, do I'm teaching people now, and they're doing it, okay? The 26 points predict institutional buying or selling in a stock institutions create momentum for stocks to move to trade and make money on the moves and that's how you make money as a trader you get in a stock that's going higher you buy it you get in a stock that's going lower you short it what are the advantages of having a trading system the advantages of having a trading system are numerous almost too numerous to talk about tonight but we are going to talk about a few all traders need to have is a system to follow and if you don't then you need one. If you're trading on the fly, take a step back, take a couple days off, take a break, because it's not a good idea. If it were e just as easy as doing whatever each and every day, then you would not need a system. However, making money in the market consistently requires a skillful system. If you follow the system correctly, you will see all the advantages each day. Now, what are some of the advantages? Preparation. I prepare to trade before the market opens. I'm completely prepared going through my rating system uh, before the market even opens. And that really gives me an edge, actually. I'm very focused. I know exactly before the open 
what stocks I like, maybe one or two, maybe three, that I'm going to focus on. Instead of scanning into the open and looking through hundreds or thousands of stocks during the live day and having absolutely no idea which one to watch to trade or what direction to take it. It really gives you focus, my system. Also, what really helps is confidence in face of the market. One advantage to having a system is it gives you confidence. You believe in what you're doing and you do it. And if you do not have confidence in the face of the market, the market will see it, just like it will see the confidence in you. The market sees me confidently going into the market and taking trades, and that helps me make money, and it can help you make money too. Another advantage of having a system is it keeps you organized. Very organized. Just because you're trading from home, if you happen to be trading from home at your home office or at a desk on a laptop or a computer, you just it doesn't mean that you don't want to be organized. You want to be just as organized at home, trading from home by yourself, even if it's only for an hour or two hours a day, as if you would be going into an office and wearing a suit. Because being organized helps you make more money. And that's another great thing about my system as well. It helps keep you organized. The advantage also of having a system is knowing directional bias. I know exactly if a stock is going to go higher or if I, I think the stock is going to go lower. I have the direction picked out before the day, and I also do not flip it, okay? I, I have a set out way to look at everything. I know what it's supposed to do. And if it doesn't do what it's supposed to do, either don't take it, or if it does something it's not supposed to be doing, then I don't flip flip it. In other words, if I see something that's no longer a short, I want to short it, then I don't flip it and go long. I stick with what I know. I stick with directional bias. I stay with it. Either works or it doesn't. Also, another advantage is knowing what to look for in the trade setups. This is BAC. This was a gap from back towards the end of April. It was last week. I know exactly what I'm looking for here. BAC gapped down in the morning. It was a short. I rated this. I knew this was a short. And so I'm waiting for the setup. If I have everything situated and figured out before the open, okay, I know exactly what to look for here when the day starts out. This is at 9.30. This is a one-minute chart. This is when the market opened here at 9.30. And the market starts to trade. I know what I'm looking for. I know what setup I'm looking for. And then when I see it, I take it. So knowing what to do ahead of time is a huge advantage because you you are when you are trading and things are happening live and the market moves fast, as you know, stocks move quickly, okay, especially ones that have a lot of volatility and momentum when we want to make money on that. We, we need to know what to do ahead of time. If we want to play on that for profit, we need to have everything figured out ahead of time that we're going to do it. And I make my list. I go through my list. I know what stocks I'm watching. This is uh, the little scanner that's on my platform here. It shows you the active stocks the, and the gainers and the losses in the NASDAQ and the New York Stock Exchange. So you can go through this each morning. This is where you're getting your picks. Uh, you're going through for the rating system. So you know what stocks to watch. Okay? You will go through it. And you're doing all of this before the market even opens. And you could start as early as 7.30 in the morning. 8 o'clock I usually start going through things. You could even prep at night. That's another great thing. If your time frame is you're in a different time zone, you can prep to go through everything at, in the evening. And also another advantage is knowing your monetary risk. This is important. I know if I risk this much money, I'm typically going to make this much money. In my system, I'm risking usually a dollar to make three dollars. That's my goal, okay? So I know my monetary risk that I want to take in the trade before I take the trade, and I know my monetary goals. I know I want to make three dollars for every dollar I take in a trade or more. And many trades that I take do make more than three. I do not take a trade on the fly where I have no idea if it's going to meet my goal. And that's what happens when you don't have everything, everything pre-planned out. You need to pre-plan out what you're doing so you know you're going to achieve your monetary goals. And having a system in place and a structure to follow helps you meet your monetary goals. And also helps you to stay within your limits. Because if you want to risk $100 in every trade, and if you didn't figure out what you're supposed to do ahead of time or how much you're supposed to risk, what if you press the button and you take 2,000 shares of something and all of a sudden you're risking $400 and you only wanted to risk 100 okay? The structure of having a system and following it helps you stay on track with your financial goals trading. Not to risk too much, risk just enough, and to stay in the trade enough to meet your goals. Another huge, big advantage of trading with a system 
is that you can gain an edge over others. Just like if you were running a race, okay, uh, you want to have an edge over the person in front of you or behind you. You want to be in front. You want to be the one that is moving forward, getting the edge, getting ahead. And having a system and a structure to follow gives you an edge. There's a lot of people that trade the market that don't have any structure at all. They have no structure. They have no system. They have no idea how much they're risking. They don't know how much they want to make. Uh, they have absolutely no idea what stocks are doing on the live day until after 9.30 a.m. And I know exactly what I'm doing before 9.30 a.m., okay? And this really, really gives me an edge. So what does a system accomplish? Well, I developed my own trading system over the course of three years. That's how long it took to put it together. The system accomplishes a method to accurately read how to take the direction of a stock. And if you take the direction of a stock correct, then you can make profit. And even as complex as trading can be at times, it's really as simple as that. Many people who lose money in, as traders or in the market don't get in the right timing and the right direction. And you must do that to trade accurately. Each morning before the open, I prepare to trade using my system in the pre-market trading. I analyze 26 points on the daily chart of a stock to determine the correct directional bias for the day. And I rain each stock each morning to calculate whether it's a long or a short or if it will have a large move of the day. I personally like to do shorts, and we're going to look at some examples today in the class on shorts, but you can do longs as well. If you don't know how to read trends, this is a great system to learn because it pinpoints the overall trend of a stock in a larger time frame. You can use the information in the 26-point rating system to train for both a short or a large time frame. So what is a strategic reason for the trains in the system? The strategic reason for taking the trades is to read what institutions are doing in stocks. And if someone on the street came up and said to me, why are you doing this stock today? Why did you want to short AVP last week? On Thursday, I think it was. Why did you want to do that, Melissa? And I'd say, because I know institutions are selling out of their long position in AVP. That's the reason that I shorted the stock, okay? You need to know and look and see what institutions are doing. And that's what the rating system teaches you. Are they buying a stock? Are they selling a stock? How can you tell what they're doing? Well, you look for the stocks that are gapping each morning or evening, and then you apply the systematic 26 points to the gap, and it tells you whether or not it's good. The reason you're taking the trade is because the 26 points give you conviction that an institution or multiple institutions will move the stock in the direction the points determine after you qualify the gap. Now, a lot of people ask me, do you need special indicators? The answer is no. Okay, there is no special software that you need to buy or indicators. You can have any uh, charting system that has a level two where you can take equity trades um, to do it. And anything you can have that you can set up charts, at least with Japanese candlesticks. I have some moving averages on my charts. However, I don't live and die by these things. And there's really no special indicator that you need to do this system. Remember, if there was some black box or special indicator that you could use that would work even 65% even of the time, okay, everyone would have it. There isn't anything like that, okay? There just isn't. There's no special indicator that works more than it does not even over 50% of the time that you can buy out there or using your platform or using or putting your charts that's going to tell you what to do. And even moving averages, which I do have in my charts, I don't live and die by them because there's many times I'll do stuff and the moving averages don't flesh out and the trade goes on to work or vice versa. So think about that if you're using indicators and, you, and you're, they're like a crutch to you because there's nothing out there that tells you exactly what to do correctly all the time or everyone would have it. So why and how does it work? Well, the system works because it acts as a looking glass into the overall daily chart bias. When the stock is gapping, there is usually a reason for the gap, or what I call a catalyst. Okay? This catalyst brings in participants of the stock, people that are long and want to sell, people that are short and want to get out with profit, people that were up money but now they are down because the stock is gapping. The 26-point system analyzes all these criteria to look into the future and predict the move the stock will make on the day. The 26 points analyze price. It is a price-based system. That is what I'm looking at in the points. That is what I would teach you. You are looking at current price, past price, and predicting with that information the future price of the stock on the day or for a larger time frame. You can even do this for swing trading, for core trading. 
or day trading, which is what I like to do. As a trader, doing this analysis ahead of time and using the 26-point system gives you a huge advantage because most people cannot predict accurately what a stock can do in one day. Not only can they not predict it accurately, they can't predict it within anywhere near um, the numbers that I can on the day or even over time. Not only does my 26-point trademark system predict the move accurately, it predicts the numbers of the move accurately, sometimes within pennies. This is a definitive edge, and it will give you an edge as a trader if you learn how to do this. Now, here's an example. This I have in the class. This is Infi. Infi actually gapped. This is back in 2013. It's a year ago, actually. Now, I squished this together. This is a bigger long-term day chart of the stock named Infi. It actually had a gap that happened back here. It opened and swooshed. Now, I'm not going to get into what a swoosh is today. That's a whole other lecture by itself. But the stock swooshed, okay? And it's, it's something that I do in the market. It's a play I do in the market. It's why I named my company the Stock Swoosh. Anyways, it swooshed. It had an amazing, beautiful, just unbelievable move for the stock. I think it moved 5 or $6 on the day here. It was, in, it was ridiculous how big it moved. It went to every past every dream target in the world. And after this happened, I looked at the longer term trade on this, and it was $10. About a week and a half ago, the stock met that target, and it's actually gone past it. You could have actually taken this as a swing trader or core trade in Infi, day traded it like I did on the day, or take it as a swing trader or core trade around $30 or thereabouts, close to $30, $29-ish. And this is a year, okay, it took a year to get to the longer term target down here to $10. You could have made $20. So you could have taken 100 shares of this and made $2,000. And you would have known that was okay using my system, understanding the scat and the way the stock moved in the day. Now, for a day trade, it was a huge trade. It was a huge trade as a day trade. I day trade on flat every day by 4 o'clock just because of the monster move that stock had. And, uh, and you can take bigger risk on, on day trades than you can for over long, long term trades. But this type of accuracy here is exactly what I'm talking about, that I know how to do this. And some days I'm even surprising myself. Another one that I did recently was Cree. I did Cree as a day trade. And the target, the dream target on Cree was actually 47.75. In three days it went there. It went to 47.83. It got within eight cents. It actually continued then. And you can see this move this had, and I did this here. Okay, this was the gap. So I got up in the morning before the open, before this thing even happened or did anything here. And I predicted, going through my system, that the stock would get to there. And it did in three days. So this is what I'm talking about. Okay, this is, this is, this is exactly how you make money as a trader. How often does it work? Gaps happen in the market every day, and sometimes there are multiple gaps per day. Personally, I like to focus on one, but you can do as many as you get. However, there are some months when two to three days will be no gaps. So you might have a couple days in a month that there won't be gaps to do. There won't, they won't meet the system. Again, what do you do? You don't trade then that day, okay? The system is there for you to follow it. It's a structure. Also, in days there are many gaps, you can take more than one trade. I did this on Friday. You can take two to five trades at a time or two to five trades in a day. I like to focus on one to two gaps per day, really one, but sometimes there's two that are so spectacular. Like on Friday, I'll do them both at the same time. Okay, it's a lot to manage for me, but I can do it. However, I will rate as many stocks as I need to in the morning to get the best stock to trade. And most days have one to three gaps that rate per the system and work. It's up to you how many trades you can manage at a time. Maybe you can manage six, seven, or eight, or nine, or ten. I'm running a live trading room while I'm trading live, so two is a lot for me at the same time, and I usually do one. But if you know, you're trading and you can manage a couple and have a few screens, you can do as many as your risk amount will allow. Gaps are very practical to trade, and this is the strategy that my system is focused around. And the reason they're so practical is because they're created with institutional money. That's what is making the gap, okay? There's some catalyst that the institutions are acting on. It could be anything, by the way. The professional gaps that happen and play out in the stocks are formed by large institutional money. And then you use a 26-point rating system to help you pick the gap. This way you get the correct direction to play the gap and confirm that the large money will flow with it. So the 26 points gives you the confirmation, the confirmation that the institutions are going to do something with this stock today and in what direction. And then you get the trade when it sets up and you do it. 
The 26-point system, Sam, is what I teach in the class. I'm not teaching you that today. I couldn't even if I tried. I couldn't even tell you that in, in one hour. It takes a whole weekend for me to teach my system. And actually, two days is a, it's a lot of information for two days. I'm telling you information about it today. By having a systematic formula to rate and qualify the gap, you get confirmation and conviction that the large institutional money is on your side, and then you play it. Gaps are an event, again, a catalyst, and they create a sense of urgency. Thus, an action is being forced by participants of the stock, whether they're long or short. This is why gap trading is incredibly powerful. This is why this strategy works so well to make these kinds of moves, like an infi. Trading gaps is a practical way to trade because you're trading on the side of power. It makes sense to be on the side of institutions who create the market in the first place. Why? Because if you get in something that isn't being traded by institutions on any given day, then the stock is hardly going to move. And then you're not going to get any play in it. And if you can't get any play in it, then you're not going to make any money. And if it doesn't move, you're not going to make any money. And sometimes stocks don't even move at all. And then there's no directional bias. It's like flat. And, and then it drives you nuts. You want to be in something that moves that you can make money in. If the goal is money, okay, which it is for anyone that's trading, then first there must be accuracy. So you need to have the goal must be, if the goal is money, the, the first thing must be accuracy. It's kind of like you can't, you can't take, you can't jump the shark, okay? It's like you, you have to actually be accurate. Then once you're accurate, the money comes after the fact. I think this is the biggest hurdle mentally that traders have, or people that want to do well in the market. And actually, if you're brand, brand new to the market, this isn't going to be a hurdle for you because you have a clean, fresh, wonderful, beautiful slate in your mind. But for people that have been trying to trade and struggling with the market back and forth for weeks or months or years, really, it's, it's a hurdle for people. They want the money, 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 okay? It's like they want instant gratification. But the fact is, accuracy is what's going to take you to the money. And, and once you are accurate, you have all the money in the world ahead of you. No, Mark, I cannot. I'm not going to. You, you've got to take the class to learn it. The goal is to trade with accuracy and detail. Detail counts. Accuracy counts. Having a system counts. It counts. And whatever you do, if you don't have a system, you don't have an edge. You don't have an edge in the market. A system is your trading plan. And again, if you don't have a trading plan, you need a trading plan to trade. A system keeps you on track, directed towards your financial trading goals so you can achieve them. Without a good system, you have anarchy in your trading and will not achieve your desired results. It's, it's kind of like you have to be your own government. You have to be your own government. You are the ch you're in charge. You're the president. You're the vice president. Uh, you're the secretary of state. You're everything. You've got to do everything, and you've got to be in charge, and you have to make all the decisions, and it's all on you. And this is where the responsibility level comes in when you're trading. And that's why having the structure helps you be responsible to yourself. The, the system helps you be responsible to yourself. So if you want to make money trading now, you can. You can, but you have to learn how first. Many people want to keep prodding along, though, in their trading. They'd rather go back and forth and back and forth and not make a full-on commitment. The commitment is in learning. That's the commitment to you uh, and what you have to do. Yeah, Sam is asking, I'm, Mark is asking, am I going to tell you one of the points? The answer is no. You have to take the class to get any of the points. I'm not going to give them to you, not even one. I do have a record, but I'm not giving it to you in writing. You can contact any one of my referrals and ask them what they think. Some of the people in my room are doing incredibly well, and have been trading with me now for well over a year. You can reach out to any of them, okay? And even though they know how to train, they are still paying me to be in my live trading room because I make great calls and they're making way more than the cost to trade with me. And, you know, I, I've got really good clients. In fact, I have clients in here today. I have clients that are, that, that, are, that are doing so well that they want to hear everything I have to say and they've already done the class. I have people in here right now that have already done the class. There's no reason for them to be here today at all other than to just hear me and learn more from me and suck up every piece of information I have to say. They've already done the class. I have great clients, and clients really respect me because they are making money on my calls. And I guess that is one of the best things that I could possibly say. So thank you, clients. Um, let me try to get through. <laughs> Phillips is correct. Thank you. And George is one of them here, too. George is here. George is about ready to quit his job. Uh, 
Let me, no, I do not have a payment plan, Sam, because you get all the information in the class right away in the first two days. That's why. You, you get the information right away in two days, so I don't have a payment plan. So you get everything you know to learn how to trade in two days in the class. So, you know, that's the, that's the thing about the payment plan. If it was stretched out, it'd be different. So this trademark system is my signature. I'm an expert chart reader. If you want to learn how to trade and make money trading, this is your opportunity to learn from me. And I think this is why my clients come to these webinars like this, even though they've done the class, because they, they want to learn more. They want to learn more. They want to get better and better and better and better. And it doesn't have to take years to learn how to trade, but it does take learning how from someone that is doing it day after day. There, Margaret. Margaret just signed up for the class too. Margaret hasn't done it, but today was her first day. There's Margaret. You have to crawl before you run. You cannot be successful in the market trading unless you know what to do. You can't. And if you decide that you really want to be good and focus on accuracy and detail, you will put yourself ahead and shoulders above the rest. You, you will do it. It's like, um, you know, I, I'm going to talk about this later at the end, but I'll say this now. We've got to get going here. The examples, we're going to run out of time. But if, if someone said to me, Do you want to go out in front of 40 billion people and trade live and make the calls? I would do it. I don't, I don't know anyone that would do that. I don't know anyone that runs a business that would do that. I don't know anyone that runs a live trading room that would do that. You have any idea how gutsy that would be to do that? I would do that if someone gave me the chance. That's how much conviction and belief system I have in the calls that I make. In fact, there are some days that I say, why are you, I said this last week on AVP, I said, why is anyone in here even looking at anything else? And, and, and we, we did AVP and it worked. There's some days that I just, I know, I know, I know some days when things are going to work. I just know. And there's one reason I know, it's because of my rating system. I just know. The goal is to trade with accuracy and detail. You have to crawl before you run. You cannot be successful in the market trading unless you know what to do. And if you decide that you really want to be good and focus on accuracy and detail, you will put yourself head and shoulders above the rest. You will. You will. And there's so much opportunity to do it. Don't you understand? There's so many people that trade that lose. You have a chance to set yourself apart for the rest. You, everybody in here. There's not, there's not like 20 million people in here today. Okay? If everyone in here wanted to set themselves apart from their friends and from the rest, you could do it. The opportunity is there because there's so many people in the market that are losing and there's so much money to be had. There's so much money to be had. That's, that's what gets me out of bed every morning. That's what gets me excited to train every day. Okay? The money. But I had to get good first. Okay? And the reason is because most people are not focused on being good. Most people aren't focused on being good. They're not focused on being good. They're not focused on being accurate. They're not focused on being experts. They're not focused on any of that at all. They are only focused on the money. And guess what they lose? I am an expert. Are you? Are you an expert? Ask yourself this. And if you're not, you want to become one. And this is why my people are here today. They want to be experts because they see the money. They see it. Now let's go over P. This was a beautiful gap that happened back here. This was in April. April was a really solid, beautiful, fantastic month. April fell, this P fell here in April, this was on the 25th, and it continued down here the second day. Again, it got up in the morning, P didn't do anything like this before the morning, P didn't do anything at all. I rated the P, I did the P, okay? I want to point something out. P was a good gap, and many people would look at this and not know what to do with it in reference to shorting it, or think it wasn't going to work, and that it was going to halt, like because of this bottoming tail thing here, or that it was actually going to be a long and fill this gap. But that's not true. P was a short. P was a great gap, and I knew P was a good gap, and P worked. P worked, and not only that, P broke this. And P had the nice follow-through, again, as a swing trade or a day trade. So this is the one-minute chart on P. You were looking to take a trade on this chart in the P. So let's look at it. The entry time was 9.46. Entry price was 25.11. If you risk an advance risk, it would be $570 or 3,000 shares. Exit 23.60. Let's go back. Let's go back and look at this. Let's just look at the chart. Forget about the money for a minute. You rate the P. You like the P. You love the P. Okay? You could have actually gone in the P here early. The P sets up here at a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful trade into a rally here at 945. And do you see what this P did? You took the trade and it just fell off a planet. 
And this all happened within 30 minutes. You took the trade at 9.45, trade is done by 10.15, okay? And this is a beautiful trade. If you just focus on this, rating the P, liking the P, doing the setup in P, and then just do it. Have all the numbers figured out, where to take it and where to get out, and all of a sudden you get out and you realize that you're up $4,500. You did not focus on the money. You focus on all of this stuff here with the P. You size yourself right if this is your risk or less than that if it is. And all of a sudden, here you go. And there's all the money. The risk to reward is almost eight. Okay? So you turn $570 into $4,530. Remember, what's my goal every day? Three. So this actually was almost quadruple what my goal was on the day. So here's a good example. I wouldn't take another trade here today. Okay? My job is done. I take this trade, I'm out of this trade, my job is done. And that's how you have to look at trading too. And that's part of having a structure and that's part of having a system, you have goals. I don't know what your goal is every day, but monetarily you have to figure it out. It should be at least three risk units, okay? So if you're risking 600 bucks, it should be at least $1,800. But once the goal is made, you're done. It's trading isn't gambling. You follow the structure, you follow the system, your goal, you've surpassed your goals for the day. You're done, okay? Now, piece it up the second day. Yes, I have a stop loss on every single trade, Mark. Mark asked a great question. I have a stop loss on every single trade. Otherwise, how do you know? Here, how do you know? This is part of the structure too, Mark. How do you know then to even know if you're doing well or not? If Here, there was a trade today. I'm not going to flip it up right now because we're going to run out of time. That had a dollar stop. It had a dollar stop. Okay, if my risk unit is between five and six hundred dollars, give or take, I can't take three thousand shares on the trade that's set up today with a dollar stop. It was Broadsoft BSFT. If I would have, how much would I risk? Three thousand dollars. I'm not risking three thousand dollars in a trade. I'm not doing that. Okay, and no one here should be doing that. But it's about the money, monetary risk. So the share size varies. Okay. And I do have a stop loss, and you do have to follow it. Otherwise, again, if you're not following a structure like that, which how much you're risking and how much you're making, then your results will be skewed. You won't have positive results. You can take one trade that works and make 4,500 and take another one that loses, and you didn't size yourself right, and you could lose 3,000, and you only wanted to lose 500. Do you see? So it has to be all of that is part of the structure. All of that is part of the system. With 26 variables, how much time does it take to analyze enough different stocks to find the highest probability trade? Are there things you use to help you decide? I use the 26 points. That's what I use. I don't use anything besides that to decide. That is what I use to decide. How much time does it take? Well, of all of these ones here, I'm going to quickly go back here very quickly to answer Jim's question. This little scanner guy here that I clipped, of all of these ones here, first of all, I focus on the shorts. So what am I looking at? I'm looking at this list. And I'm looking at this list. So that already narrows it down. I'm not rating every one of these gaps because sometimes I'll automatically see them and I'll say no, 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 no. And I can tell right away if something isn't good. So once you learn the system, you'll, your eye will see that's not good, that's not good, that's not good, that's not good. Oh, that looks good. Oh, that one looks good. Oh, that one looks good. And then you'll make a little short list. It could have eight things in it. And then you rate as many as you want to. It takes between five, six, seven minutes, I'd say, per one to rate for me, okay? And if you're brand new, it might take you 10 minutes, but it doesn't take a million, uh, a million hours. And again, I'm only focusing in one direction. It's going to take you a little more time. You're focusing in both directions. I think you should learn how to trade one thing in one direction, though, first. Do it really, really well, and then you can do both directions. All right, so let's look at the P2. P here, set up again. Do you see this? Do, 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 and came all the way down. Now, this was a little bit longer of a trade, 1030 to 130. Okay, you're in this actually for three hours, but you're up a million miles the whole way down. Um, and you actually might have gotten out of this here around the lunchtime period, but it did roll out and had a beautiful exit down in here into a number. Entry time was 1035. This is a continuation of the original P. Price is 20, 23.81. So here we have it. Mark had asked about the sizing. This one would not warrant 4,000 shares or it'd be more than $600. It's 2,500. Exit's 2148. 
Total profit, 58.25. Again, look at the money you can make if you're not focused on that. And instead, what are you focused on? P. P, 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 P. That's what you're focused on. You're not looking at your P&L. What's the worst thing that can happen to you if the trade stops out? You lose exactly what you were willing to lose, 600 bucks. And again, you can divide this by two or three quarters, however much you're willing to, to risk. The risk to reward is 9.7 times the amount risk made in profit. That's a great trade. That's a beautiful trade. Philip's saying he can see. Can everybody see my ticker here? I don't know if what happened was a fat finger by Kevin or if something happened with the PowerPoint. Just let me know if everybody can see my, my arrow here. Anyways, another great trade in P. Let's go back to the original look here. I do have a cursor. I do have this here. Can you see it? So what may P give you even the opportunity to move like this or this or even make any kind of that money? 4,000, 5,000, anything. What was, what was, what, how could you have even done it? What, how did you even know to do it? The rating system, the rating system, the rating system. How did I know when P was, before P even did a, before 930, before 930, I knew P was good. And that's why all of this does this, because of the rating system, because I rated the P. Yes, I have a stop loss in every trade. I absolutely have a stop loss in every trade. Mark's asking good questions. I have to, and you should too. I know some people poo-poo stop losses, but I don't. And look at the size I'm taking. I'm putting them in, okay? I, I must, okay? If, if something doesn't work, I want to be out, okay? Total profit in P in two days. Day one P risk, 570 bucks. Day one P profit, 45.30. Day two P risk, 600. Day two P profit, 58.25. Total risk in P in two days. Day one and day two, two days in a row. 1170. Now, again, this is an advanced risk, but it was only in two trades. Total profit in P. If you risk $1,170, you could have made over 10 grand in P. You, you, you could have just gone to the beach, okay, for the rest of the week, okay? That's as in two days. Total risk to reward in P, over eight. Now, let's go to the next one here. Lo and behold, another beautiful, beautiful, beautiful gap, camp. Okay, camp gapped. How did I know camp would do this or something similar to this or even this? Because I rated the camp. I used the 26 point rating system before this even opened. And I'm rating it and I know it's good and I know it's gonna work and it does. And I'm predicting this ahead of time before 9.30 that the stock's gonna do this in the day. And then it does it. Camp. In fact, this, I didn't even see this. I remember this. This was, for some reason, it ended up uh, doing this here. But I remember when this was actually alive on the day, this had, it, the bar was weird. It actually had a big red bar, like I couldn't see the open. I like, actually, I remember that. It was weird. Anyways, this, this camp set up, set up and look what the camp did. This is right at the beginning of the day, comes on down, set up again, came on down, or you stayed with the first original trade. Entry time in camp was 10.30 if you wanted to do the full-on uh, setup to the lower time frame. Actually, no, that wasn't 21. No, it was, uh, no, it was in 10.30. It was 9.33, 9.30, 9.31, 9.32. No, it was 9.32. At the time wrong. Here's the entry. It was 9.32. Uh, risk is 2,200 shares. Again, you can't take 3,000. If you take 3,000 here, you're risking more than 572, okay? Exits 1905, total profit over 4,800. Risk to reward is 8.4. Again, great trade. So if your goal is three hours a day and there's five days in a week, and let's say one day you don't get anything to trade, let's be really, really, really conservative. One day a week, you figure you're not going to do anything on a Monday, which is a low, low trading day for activity. You say four days a week. Your goal is to make 12 hours a week. Okay, that's your goal. You, you just made eight in this one trade, and you made eight in the P if you did them both. So you made 16 hours then for the week. 
just in two days of trading if you did them both, or if you only did the one here, okay, you made eight hours in this one trade, your goal is 12 for the week. This is very, 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 very reasonable, okay? Some people think it's insane to try to make 10 hours a week or 12 hours a week. It's a very reasonable goal, and that means even almost not trading one day. Now, day two, camp set up again. Same thing as a P with a follow through. Beautiful, beautiful move in the camp on the second day down. Here's the open. Here's where it falls. Okay. Entry time. Now, this entry time was at 1030. Price is 1862. Exit 1730. Risk is $520 on 4,000 shares. You must risk the same amount. Total profit 5280. Another great trade, 10 hours. 10 hours in this, if you risked the advanced amount, you could have made over $5,000. How can you make $5,000 in a trade? You don't close your eyes and trade it on the fly. You know the camp is good. You know the gap yesterday rated whatever it rated. You know it rated per the 26-point system. You know it has a follow-through. You see it the next day. It falls off a cliff into the open, rallies back and sets up, drops, rallies back and sets up, and drops. This is a great gap, and you look for the follow-through, and it does it. And again, you could be in any of these a swing or core day trades. It doesn't matter. All of them kept going. Day one camp risk 572. Day one profit 4800. Day two camp risk 520. Day two camp profit 5200. Total risk in camp was advanced 1092, and you could have made over $10,000 in this stock symbol in two trades. In two trades. In two trades. And that doesn't include the P. Total profit in two stock symbols in four days of trading in one month. This is one month. This is two days. April 25th and April 28th. Two days and two stocks. There's a whole month to trade. You got a whole month to trade and you could have made up 20 grand in these two stock symbols. That's You could have made that. No, it's not out the low. These aren't out at the low. These aren't out the low at all, David. Go look at the charts. They're out at the exact numbers. I'll tell you exact, exactly what they are here. This is an exit for me. It's called a double bottom. Again, you learn this in the class. This is an exit. Okay. And hey, listen, you know, David seems to think that I'm making this up. Well, there's people that are trading with me that I know I'm not making it up because I call this stuff live. And if you don't think that I know how to trade, then don't take my class, okay? That's all I have to say. It's not for you if you think I'm making it up. I have too many people that are trading with me live to say these things in a live thing. And I just told you people are here. People are here that are trading with me in the room that did these trades and, and took these trades, okay? I couldn't possibly say that I made these calls if I didn't. So think about it. What if you only risked half of this amount or a quarter of this amount? Total profit in two stock symbols in four days of trading in one month. This is if you divide it by half. Then this is if you divide it by a quarter. In other words, if you didn't want to risk an, an advanced amount, you could have risked less than 600. You could have only risked 300 to trade. You still would have made over 10,000. You could have risked 150 in the trade, and you still could have made 5,100. Okay? So would you like to make this kind of money in four days? Yes, of course you would. And obviously, David is, uh, you know, doesn't believe it. And my guess is that David probably has lost money in the market. And, you know, when you're at a point where you have a negative attitude about being successful in the market, then that's the point you should quit. You should stop trading. You should stop going to webinars, okay? You have to have a positive attitude and believe that you can make money in the market. If you have a negative attitude and don't believe that anything can work, then you're at the point where you're up against the wall and you should quit, okay? Oh, there we go. Jim, Jim, I, Jim, I don't know who you are, <laughs> but Jim just said, I watched her trade live on one day and called the exit price well in advance, hit it right on cue. Oh, thank you, Jim. Yeah, uh, Sam, you can get, um, here, email me here for, uh, for references. I tell you, I love, somebody asked me the other day, it was Les. Les asked me the other day, I don't, I don't know if Les is here right now. 
He said, do you like, you know, talking to people, you know? And, and I said, sure, I like talking to people. You know, obviously I talk to people. I'm, I'm doing everything. I call the trains. I trade. I do the webinars. I teach the class. I do it all. I'm a one-woman show. I said, I'd love to talk to people. But, you know, I do have a, a short fuse, I guess, by and by. As the days go on, the more money that I make trading myself, meaning that if I see someone has a negative attitude or if they question me too much, then I'm not going to spend a lot of time with that person. Your best way road to success is to learn from me directly. So keep that in mind, okay? Because if you want me to uh, respect you, then you got to take it seriously. And you have to take seriously what I'm saying. And there'll come a day when you wish that you would. Now, I know everybody has issues that they have to work out in their mind mentally. But you go see a therapist for that. You don't work it out with me. Okay, I'm going to, here to teach you how to trade. I'm here to help you make money, to call the trades live. Some of you have been trying to do this for years and years going down your roads, need see some other sources, and you can do that on your own. I'm here to actually do it, get it done, to make the money. That's, that's what I'm here for. And you want me on your side, okay? You want me on your side. I think that's why the people that are here today that have already learned from me, they, they get that. They understand that. I'm a, I'm a good uh, ally. Could you make this kind of money in four days? Yes, if you want to become a good trader. Yes, if you're willing to learn something new. And no, if you're not. Okay. Yes, if you're willing to risk an intermediate to advanced risk in each trade, which $300 to $500 is advanced. Yes, if you have a minimum of $75,000 in buying power. That's not cash, it's buying power. And yes, if you want to take the Golden Gap course and learn the 26-point rating system. Would you like to make this kind of money in four days? Would you like to make this kind of money? Yes, of course you would. Anyone would. And who will? Who will make this kind of money? People that believe that they can. I always believe that I can make a lot of money in the market. Now, at the time that I started out and I didn't know what to do, that wasn't a great thing because I lost a lot trying to figure this out. But I always knew I could make a lot. And lo and behold, now I am. You do have to believe that you can do it and you do have to believe you can make this kind of money from the market. Many people will never, ever, 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 ever make this kind of money trading. Many people will never make it. They will never believe that they can. They will never figure out right. And they will never follow structure or system or ever connect with someone like me to teach them what to do. So if you can learn it, you're going to have an edge. Just from the very fact that there's so few people that are actually doing it, okay? Just from the very fact that you're choosing to learn a system, deciding you want to do it, believing that you can, you have an edge. The fact that I made a system, believe that I could do it, is, actually gives me an edge. And the fact that I'm doing it, okay? And actually, the fact that I'm teaching people gives me an edge, too, because it's helping my own confidence level to be able to say, I can go out there into the world and make these calls ahead of time. Sometimes I'm on YouTube making videos before the stock even gaps, saying that it's going to gap, okay? Calling the overall directional bias, like Crete. If you want to make this kind of money in just four days of trading, then you have to decide to make a level of commitment to learning the system, and that involves taking the Golden Gap course and learning it. Here's where it comes to what everybody wants, everybody wants in the world. It's, it's actually like sex, okay? Everyone wants instant gratification. Many traders want instant gratification. Money and sex, there's a lot of correlations, actually. And the longer I teach and the more people I talk to, I realize this. The great thing about trading gaps as a strategy is you do get instant gratification in the money you make. You do. You get it in the money you make in the morning trades because they usually move pretty fast. However, the idea of instant gratification doesn't help you become a good trader, okay? It doesn't help you become a good trader, all right? Just like it doesn't necessarily help you forge a good relationship with someone if all you're interested in is sex. You have to think about the long term. That doesn't mean you're not going to make money in the short term, okay? But you're building something. What you're building is a solid foundation for your financial future, and it's not going to happen overnight. If you want to make this kind of money, not just in four days of trading, but week after week, month after month, and for the rest of your life, it's like marriage. You're getting married to the market. Then you need to see trading for what it really is and can be for your life in the bigger picture. What can it be in your life for the bigger picture? 
for the bigger picture is you learn how to train, you learn a system you can use for the rest of your life. And you can make money training for the rest of your life. So pish ta, the $2,500 that it costs for the class, if I can teach you something that you can make money for the rest of your life. You'll make way more than $2,500 if you use the system correctly over the course of your life. It will add up far greater. And you have to look at the bigger picture. And if you're too short-sighted, if you're too focused on instant gratification, then you're not committed to your own financial future and success. And I was committed to my financial future and my own financial success because I had a job. At the time when I started doing this, I was making uh, money doing mortgages. I was making good money. And I realized that I wasn't going to be, uh, that job wasn't going to last. And so I was committed to my future for the moment when I started to trade. When I first started out, I was making really good money doing loans. But I, I, knew, I saw the writing on the wall. I saw the writing on the wall for my future that it wasn't going to be there five years down the road, ten years down the road. Okay, I needed, I knew I needed to make some changes now so that five years down the road I wouldn't be left, you know, in a different financial situation. I wanted to make the changes for my future, and I was young enough to do it. Okay, so it's never, never too early to start. The bigger picture is personal freedom, the freedom to be able to work for yourself. The freedom to be able to choose your and set your own hours. The freedom to be able to make the money that you want to make, okay? And that's the bigger picture. Many traders want instant gratification. That does not mean that you can't take the class and start making money the next day. But the fact is that you have to look at the bigger picture if you really want to make much more, using the examples that I showed you today, unless you have the money to do it, okay? But you have to learn it first. The great thing about trading gaps as a strategy is you do get instant gratification in the money you make in morning trades because they usually move pretty fast. However, the idea of instant gratification doesn't help you become a good trader. The idea of focusing too much on the money doesn't help you become a good trader. If you want to make this kind of money not just in four days of trading but week after week, month after month, and for the rest of your life, then you need to see trading for what it really is and can be for your life in the bigger picture. I actually think that Trading is meant for people that have the right attitude. And I know exactly what that is. You have to be willing to take risk. You have to be willing to take a chance to look into your future and not know the outcome. The same as you do with a trade. And you have to have a certain level of commitment. And you have to be willing to spend money. You have to be willing to spend money in your trade. And you have to be willing to spend money in a class. And if you're not willing to do any of those things, then trading isn't for you. And trading isn't for everyone. It's just not, even though a lot of people will do it. And actually, there's a lot of people that trade in the market. Trading is not for them. They trade and they lose. And guess who's getting their money? Me, okay? You know that when you trade and place a trade, when I make money, I'm taking it from someone else. When you make money, you're taking it from someone else. That's where how it works. The bigger picture is really financial freedom to be able to set your own course. It's all about conviction. Having an edge gives me conviction and it will give you conviction too. The Golden Gap system is a 26 point professional bearish gap rating system and the purpose of the system is to help you evaluate which stock that is gapping to trade each morning using a checklist. And the system also teaches you the entries and the exits. David was asking earlier about the exits. If you take the entries I'm calling, David, it doesn't matter if you don't get out at the low of the day. Whether you make 8 R's or 6 R's or 5 R's or 4 R's or 6.275, if you get the exits and get the stock right, you can get out whenever you want. You can get out in 15 minutes and make money. You can get out in 5 and make money. You can hold it to the target if you want to make money. You can trade in the morning before you have to go to work and just get out, even if it's still going because you have things to do. It's about getting the right stock getting the right pick, getting the direction right, and more than that, getting the entry right, which is something that I excel at. So why does it work? The Golden Gap system works because it looks at a large time frame in the daily chart of a stock to analyze the directional bias. It looks at the larger time frame, the daily chart, the bigger time frame. I'm a day trader, but I'm looking at the bigger time frame, and that's why it works for Swinger Core Trades too. The quality and high success rate for choosing the right stock to trade each day and getting the directional bias correct comes from the 26-point rating system. So using a 26-point checklist system to trade gives me an edge. It's my trading plan. And it looks at a larger time frame. This is the BSFT. This was this morning, okay? Looking at the BSFT before the morning. Here, actually, I'll tell you what I did with this quickly. I rated this gap. It was all the way up here. I figured out all the targets. 
The stock moved down in the morning and hit through all the targets in the gap. It actually, I was just watching it. I rated it early because I started at 8 o'clock. I rated it like it was around up here, 24 or something. The stock went down and blew through all the exits in the morning in the pre-market. I just watched it. It wasn't in it. I watched the whole thing. Then it still opened down here and worked as a short. But here's one where I had all the targets figured out and it did it in the pre-market. Actually, that happens a lot. But I looked at this in a daily chart. Entries are on a smaller time frame for risk to reward. So the entry on BSFT, if you wanted to do it today in the one minute, was here. Again, this is a one minute chart. Entries on a small time frame, the overall directional bias to the downside in BSFT on a bigger time frame. This is what the 26 points helps you pull together. The philosophy behind the 26 points is to have a high probability directional bias for the day, big moves, early confirmation of the move before 10 o'clock, and precise entries with follow through and a good risk to reward. So the Golden Gap course is the class that I teach the rating system in. It teaches you how to find the best stock to trade each day, the entries, the exits. And again, you're, the exits are something that you can work on yourself. I teach you the exits in the class. Whether or not you're going to hold them all day, if you have something else to do, it's up to you. But you've got to get the stock right. And you've got to get the entry right. Otherwise, you're not going to make any money at all. The course teaches price analysis and technical analysis on an advanced level. And it teaches a detailed way to read support and resistance in the right direction. And it teaches you how to make money. Okay, I'm teaching people how to make money. That's the object. Whether you make three R's or four R's or eight R's or seven R's, the idea is you're up. When most traders are down, you, you are profitable if you learn how to do the system. And it gives you an edge, the checklist. A system helps you make money. A system helps you get serious about your trading. A system helps you focus. And you've got to ask yourself, are you focused? If you're too focused on the money, then you're probably losing. And don't have a system that works. A system helps you get serious about making money because it teaches you what to focus on in the charts, the price, because you're just focusing on that system. That's what you're following. That's what you get up. That's what you look at. And it gives you an edge. And you absolutely need a system to be successful in the market. Okay? It gives you an edge to trade. And why do you need an edge? Because there's a sea of traders out there. There's a sea of traders out there trying to take your money. Every day, they're out there trading, trying to take your money. Are they going to be successful taking their, their mo your money? Or are you going to take their money? Okay? Remember, you're out there every day. If there's a sea of traders, and this is why you need an edge. So empower yourself today to learn how to trade. It's a complete system to use how to trade that I teach in the class. It's a full two-day course on how to strategically find, pick, and play stocks at a professional bearish gaps. Retakes are free. Uh, the class is online. So the retakes are free, meaning you can take the class and then retake the class as many times as you need to after the fact to get the information down more accurately. The dates of the class are May 10th and 11th from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. Eastern Time. Again, the class is online. You can be anywhere in the world and take it. The cost is $2,499. Contact me at Melissa at thestockswish.com if you would like to sign up. And one last thing people are asking me, honestly, 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 you got to have $2,500 to be in the market. If you don't have $2,500 to take the class, you probably don't have enough money to trade. you got to have money to trade. Don't put yourself into this market not knowing what you're doing, okay? You, you can't put yourself in the market without knowing what you're doing. It's a good $2,500 to spend. And I'll send referrals to anyone that wants to learn my system. You can learn the system and make the money back in one trade, you know, if you're going to follow my trades. I also teach a class called the Trends Course. This is June 10th and 12th, from 12 to 4. Cost of this class is $9.99. It's a course on how to read trends and stock charts. And I'm running a special this month. You can do both classes and save $499. So you can do the Golden Gap class and the Trends class. If you'd like to swing trade or core trade, that's a great class for that. The class would be $2,999, $2,999 for both of the classes. You'd save almost 500 bucks. If you're interested in this, email me at melissa at thestockswish.com. Second quarter is upon us. Good trading for the rest of this whole month while second quarter is running on. There'll be a little bit of lull in June, and then I'll start up for third quarter towards the end of June. And it's a great time to trade because there's a lot of gaps and a lot of follow through like you saw. Remember, the future is yours to create. You could be like these people here, okay, these sour pusses, or you could be like this person here. When you walk down the street, this person gets noticed. He's very attractive. He's very confident. He dresses very nice, and he can afford to do so. 
and these people here can't get a date to save their life. So <laughs> what do you want to be? Do you want to be like this person or do you want to be like these people? A sea of traders losing. So you got to ask yourself, because this can be you, because there's a lot of these people. So even if everybody here looked like this guy, it still would be a lot of these people. So think about it. If you want an edge, and here's my town, New York. Remember, the future is yours to create. Thank you, everybody, for coming. Email me at melissa at thestockswish.com if you'd like more information. We have like a minute here for questions if anybody has any more questions. Email me if you want references. No one said anything simple, Sam. You have to learn it. I mean, you've got to learn what to do. You And I have no idea what you know. I don't know if you're going to think the class is easy or hard. I, I don't know. The people that are here, <laughs> people that are here that did the class, is the class hard or easy? I don't know. You tell me. You're better off asking other people if the class is hard or easy. Oh, yeah, it's, it's hard for me to say anymore because I have been doing this now for so long. For me, it is easy. So uh, most days are very easy for me, but it's because I've been doing it now for over five years. <laughs> sure, so once again, super job. Always helpful to hear it again. Never knew you had so many sour pusses around. <laughs> You're welcome, Tab. I'll keep up the good work just for you. All right, everybody. Have a great weekend. Thanks so much, Online Trader Central. Have a great weekend. What am I saying? It's Monday night. Have a great Cinco de Mayo. <laughs> Good night.